Hello and welcome to the Etihad Stadium. Derek Ray here on the commentary box, joined as always by former England defender Lee Dixon. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Manchester City facing Burnley. Yeah, thank you, Derek. I'm really looking forward to this. Both teams certainly capable of producing some entertaining football. Hopefully we'll get that. Fernandinho. Well, you can't watch Kevin De Bruyne and not be impressed, Lee. What in particular are you anticipating seeing from the Belgian in this match? Well, if I'm a teammate of this lad, I want to get the ball to him as often as I can because he's a safe pair of hands. Give him the ball, normally something happens. The link-up play between the different departments of the team is second to none. The ball with Rodri. De Bruyne. Cross towards that far post. Very clear who got the last touch. So a corner coming up. And so the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson, the Brazilian, between the posts. Alexander Zinchenko starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne starts with Rodri in central midfield. And leading the line is Sergio Aguero. Firing it towards goal. Tremendous block. Mares. Aguero. And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. Well, you think back to last season's title race and you think back to some of the key moments. City's win over Liverpool in January, so important in the grand scheme of things, Lee. Well, it was. I remember people talking about it being a title decider on the 3rd of January. It's ridiculous, but as it happens, pivotal moment in City winning the title, you have to say, in hindsight, absolutely. And Sterling has it. The keeper was up to the task. Well, it's a decent effort, but it's a real opportunity goes begging there. And a chance for him on the flank. Space and time for the cross. to try to make it a bit more difficult for your opponent the mat Barnes and Chris Wood he cuts it back simple save for the keeper well he had to pick the fly to the ball up that was all got behind it good save Walker now might be able to produce from this position he might be able to profit from the wide position will he play it in Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Well, nothing he could really do based on the cross. Barnes giving them the gift of possession. They all know their roles as they apply the pressure. De Bruyne now. David Silva. Sterling. Here's Aguero. A good and fair challenge. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Wood with it. It's with Barnes. Westwood. Wood. It did look on for them, but not to be. Walker failed to hold it. Can they take the lead here? And that is defending of the highest order. Well, City controlling the lion's share of possession, but I don't think the manager or the fans will be too happy with this performance. It's all been a little bit too slow, too pedestrian. They need to find another gear if they're going to go on and win this. They do pass the ball with authority. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. De Bruyne, here's Mares, De Bruyne, it's with David Silva, they're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them, the fourth official Aguero, there will be a minimum it's there for him, my goodness that save, fully stretched he was, one for his own highlights reel, Kevin De Bruyne with the corner, and punched away, 
And with that, the first half draws to a close. Really tense battle so far. And now the second half is underway. And it's with Hendrik. Tremendous intuition to win it back. And the attacking options appear plentiful. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. And it's with Hendrik, untidy in possession. Aguero. It's with David Silva, losing possession here. Individual quality coming to the fore. A really sumptuous ball. He's gone for power, Lee, but it's wide. Well, no real direction, but the power was there. And you're right, it's just gone past the post. Fernandinho with it. Alexander Zinchenko. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. Opportunity to take the lead. Straightforward take. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. Westwood. And he was in the right place to intercept. Jeff Hendrick. He could pick out a teammate. And the decision is one of offside here. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. The ball with Rodri. But a shocking pass, really. Couldn't keep it. possibilities on the flank for City here now Zinchenko Silva and now Rodri not the easiest of situations for the keeper played into the centre of the box well a sloppy clearance what can the opposition do with this De Bruyne tremendous block Cork, they've given it away. Bernardo Silva, De Bruyne, now Mares, Rodri. He must finish. An important save it was to keep this game goalless. Yeah, the first goal is always important in a game, but the keeper had other ideas. What? A and a chance for them to nudge in front. And a smart stop to prevent the opening goal of the contest lead. Terrific work from the keeper to keep the scores level at 0-0. Foiling them effectively. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Sterling, Rodri, a bit of running room now on the wing, the Bainet, plattered away, you never quite know when it's going to be last chance saloon time, City have a corner, and Manchester City will go to their bench, Rodri! Lacking in direction with that header, he was under duress. Yeah, the defender just put him off a little bit, but it was worth an effort. If he goes in, he's a hero. It's with Gundogan. De Bruyne. It's with Bernardo Silva. Here's Mares. The cross is on. Bernardo Silva. Gundogan. Here's De Bruyne, 
And Bernardo Silva has it. And now Rodri. And the goalkeeper, as you would expect, once again doing his job. Yeah, that's it, his job. Get behind the ball and save it. And just the one minute left in normal time here. And the referee blows his whistle. Still all square after 90 minutes.